All right, it can be difficult to take care of ourselves during the long, mm -hmm. cold months to come. So today we're talking easy steps that you can take to maintain your health this winter. Dr. Olga Garcia from UI Health is here with more. Welcome, Dr. Garcia. Thank you so much. Okay, so you're in primary health, you're an internist. Okay, what are some things that we can do to take better care of ourselves during the winter months? So winters in Chicago can be difficult and a stressful time. Yeah. Um, one is because we're the cold weather, we are not as active. Uh, this is a, a time of the year that we get together with large group of people, so it's easy to pick up germs, I'm right? And we have a tendency to overindulge. <laughs> oh, I don't know what you're talking go. about, Dr. Olga. <laughs> so we need to be careful with that. So there's a few things that we can do to uh, keep our health and, and it's be mindful, I'm right? So, uh, mindful eating, instead of eating a lot of sweets mm. and fatty appetizers, I recommend more fruits, vegetables, high protein snacks. I recommend a small plate so you can watch your portion. It's important to stay hydrated Ooh, during yes. the winter time because we're indoor and there's a lot of, uh, because the heater's on and the lack of right. moisture in the air, mm -hmm. we get our dry skin. We get dry eyes, yes. but most importantly, we can get he uh, dehydrated. So yes. drinking water is important. Um, stay active indoor. Any kind of uh, routine exercise, any exercise, any video that you can do, even climbing up and down stairs at home is good enough. Um, stay connected. This time of the year, there's a lot of loneliness. People can feel lonely. So check in on your friends, family, mm. co-workers, just whether via online, phone, or just show up, I'm right, being yeah. in person. Um, the other one, get vaccinated, that is very important. Okay. This is a time of respiratory viruses, so flu, COVID, RSV. So we recommend that if you're sick, stay home and continue to practice good hygiene. In addition, I would say get vaccinated. Flu is uh, recommended for anyone that is six months and older. The RSV is recommended for young children and anyone who is 60 years and older, and of course the COVID booster. And see your doctor. Yes. It's important to keep your appointments. And remember, it's a stressful time of the year, so a stress can lead to other medical problems, so discuss your stress levels with your doctors. How often should we be seeing a primary doctor? Because I think some women always yeah. see a gynecologist once a year, but you should also be going to a primary care. Correct. And it will depends. We recommend at least to see the primary care doctor once a year because you want to discuss early concerns before they become bigger problems. Mm -hmm. all right? And if you have chronic medical conditions, we recommend to see it on a regular basis or every three or six months, depends on how is your health. It's so easy to put off going to go see a doctor. And if someone's watching right now and they're hesitant to actually make that call, what would you say to them? Well, we're, as doctors, we're here to help them, right? We're here to evaluate your health the best way possible. It's never too late. Make your appointment. It's, if you haven't seen your doctor in years, make your appointment right now. It's, it's, we're always happy to see our patients. At UI Health, we have doctors that uh, specialize in various uh, primary care, like um, pediatricians who chil see children or family medicine who see the whole family. In internal medicine, they see 18 and older. And as a provider, I can refer you to a um, specialist if you, I have a more concern or anything Perfect. that is more specific. Two things, make your appointment and make time for your health. I it's very important. Thank you, Dr. Garcia. Thank you for You're having so me. Fabulous. Oh my Thank goodness. you. Thank you. So on. Schedule your appointment with a UI health doctor in order to stay on top of your health by calling 866-600-CARE or visiting uihealth.care to schedule online. Thanks again, doctor.